morning, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. As I told you last week, today, if you do not have your PVC with you, you will not attend mass here today. It's as serious as that. When I said it, some of you, you took it for granted as if we are joking. And as you know, the federal government has given deadline that at the end of this month, the registration will stop. And we had already discussed this with the school management, that any student who does not have his or her PVC will automatically have carryover. Yes. And beginning from today, if you do not have your PVC, you cannot enter this chapel today and celebrate Mass with us. It's as serious as that. And, and for those of you coming from just Archdiocese, you must have known that it is said in just Archdiocese that if you do not have your PVC, you cannot receive communion. But here we know not everybody is a communicant. So what we'll do is, from today, if you, don't, if you are coming for Mass, carry your PVC. If you don't have your PVC, don't bother coming. Because there is no point having Christians fill the church. But during election, we have only a handful of them go out to vote. So it means our number, our population means nothing. So we want Christians to take their responsibility and their role seriously. So today, I am serious about it. As I'm standing here, if you have your PVC, begin to come in. But if you don't have your PVC, find your way back home. You will not attend Mass here today. Is that clear? Yes. Cross with your PVC. Oh yeah, begin to come in. Oh yeah. Those who don't have their PVC, you begin to go back. I'm serious about it. Uh -huh. Those who don't have PVC, oh yeah, go back home. If your number cannot add anything to Christianity, neither will your access reduce anything. Thank you.